Just showing a quick little update since I put the elderberries in the ground. Today is February 14th. They already got some. Putting off some new leaves. Look like some little runners down there. This is the York elderberry. February 14th. Just doing a little size comparison so we can see what it looks like at the end of the growing season. See you on the next one, folks. This is the wildwood elderberry. She's putting off a little bit of new leaves. And not much, but as long as she's healthy and still alive. Once again, it's February 14th. This here is the Bob Gordon elderberry. Putting off a nice amount of new leaves. Once again, February the 14th. Here's the black lace elderberry. Definitely putting off some new leaves. Look at the beautiful sheen. And those leaves, that beautiful color. Can't wait to see this one. About six, eight feet tall. I know there's gonna be a beautiful bush over here. Let's move on to the next one. This here is the unknown variety I have. I got it from a nursery that sells on Walmart. They said they uh they know it's one of the European varieties. The uh, elderly gentleman who started the nursery years and years ago, planted in his backyard, but uh, they just recently decided to start selling some of them. They said they cannot remember which one it was that he planted, but they know for a fact that it was one of the European varieties, so we just have to just keep a close eye on it and see if we can identify it later on. This here is another one of the uh, unknown varieties from the same company. They sent me two extra. It's apparently, it's supposed to be two that comes in the package. But the first package I got only had one in it. So I called them up and they sent me these two back out free of charge. The reason these are in the bucket now, I have three more varieties coming. Um, so I'm probably gonna be saving these to take out the plant out on some family land. But I'm also looking to do some things myself this year. So these will be used for a much larger project, hopefully sometime this year. But they're definitely putting on a good bit of new growth too, to be in the pots. Like I said, these are the unknown variety, but uh, I do my best to try to identify them once they grow more and start producing. But uh, stay tuned, everybody. Stay safe and stay blessed and keep growing.